Reese gets his chance. Away comes Ali. Far post is Kitson. Oh, the goalkeeper made a marvellous one-handed save then. And Kerry Evans belted it behind for a corner. Well, that was a typical case of wanting the pass back to your goalkeeper and knowing you can't really safely do it there. Michael Ford was caught on his wrong foot and he just tried to knock a little ball instead of hitting behind the opposing fullback. Good work by Paul Rees, born in Nottingham. Free kick in towards Short and the goalkeeper again looking very confident and good handling. The arm power of a heavyweight boxer really hurls these in. And Short and that was another fine piece of goalkeeping. Craig Short came up there for the long throw and he got a good touch. I possibly may have just impeded the man in front of him, but uh, I couldn't see a lot wrong with it. The referee's in a better position than me. But Paul Reese looked very agile there. Yeah? Kitson. Good play by Paul Kitson. Excellent play. And looks to set up his captain. And that was a great shot by Forsyth. Simpson's kept it in. Goal kick the outcome. And once again, Paul Reese to Oxford's rescue as Michael Forsyth really tested him then. And Paul Reese took off like Batman he got going across there. Beautiful strike. Here he is taking off. Good save. Well played, Paul Reese. Most of the slip, and he's got Gabbiadini and Kitson ahead of him. He goes alone, and another fine save by Paul Reese. Brilliant save with his left hand. He's come, he's narrowed the angle. He was out near the six yard box when he got his touch there, Paul Reese. But it was, it was an expensive slip by Mike Ford. He just sort of kept his feet and kept goal side, but he went, hesitated, and then lost his balance. The referee has blown the whistle to signal the end of the first half. And the referee gets the second half underway. I'll be counting on by Gabbiadini and receives it well and takes on the defender. Brilliant, brilliant Gabbiadini. And it's still almost rebounded in. That Gabbiadini was... was so unlucky there. Great bit of skill. He took his defenders on. He's got his strike in and he is so unlucky not to score the goal. Good turn here, through the legs, not meant to recall that. He's got round his defender, come inside, done everything right, looks up, but a great save by our man in goal there. He could be greasy man of the match the way he's going. Another long throw, short the target again, and he won it! And once more, Reese made a splendid one-handed save. He's done very well short. There was one in front and one behind, they're both trying to squeeze him in, he's got the leap, he's got the touch, and Paul Reese, a superb save. Fifteen minutes to go, still no goals on. You see uh, either side being able to win this one now. Wanting the ball, well, rushed into the box for Pembridge, obliges this time, Kitson. The side, oh, oh great save again by Reese. A real bend on it that shot and I think he was almost committing himself one way and fished out an arm and kept the ball out. Going the wrong target. He's been throwing himself out and as you said that was very difficult. He was going the wrong way and he threw himself back, got his right arm behind the ball and made a superb save. Well by short. Turning shot! It's a goal! Oxford United have taken the lead. 12 minutes to go. And Dernin finds the net with a superb strike. There. Forsyth again. Simpson and the former Oxford man come to their rescue. The ball, Kitson. Good turn by Kitson. And Reese did well then because it took a little wicked deflection on route, although it wasn't powerfully hit. I've been waiting for Kitson to turn on the ball all the match, and that's the first time he's actually done it. And it's a great save because, as you say, it took a wicked deflection there, and he covered it full stretch, got his arm to it. Another good save. Well, confirmation now from Jimmy Greaves in the studio that Paul Reese of Oxford United has been voted Barclays Man of the Match. No argument from anyone about that, I'm sure. Certainly not from uh, our commentary position, though, John. No doubt whatsoever. He's been in the class of his own. Hey. And that's it. It's all over. Oxford United have earned three points here. A fabulous goal by John Dernin and a fabulous performance.
performance by their goalkeeper and man of the match, Paul Rees. Sterling absolutely delighted. So is Rees about his contribution.